Hello, today I'm going to show you how to make a photo look like it's an old photo. We're going to use the pixlr.com website. Open the image, select the image you want to look for your age. Usually you could do one of a person. And once I have that photo open, I'm going to choose um, the adjustment. Hue and saturation, and I'm going to reduce the saturation to zero, which will make the photo black and white. It removes all of the color. Now I'm going to go back to the adjustment. I'm going to select sepia. Now I'm going to choose in the filter menu. Choose noise, and I'm going to make uh, the amount to 30. Please notice the photo has a little bit of a greeny look. Now I'm going to add a new layer to this. You see my layers menu over here. Select new layer. I'm going to Double-click and rename this frame. Make sure you're on the new frame layer. You're going to choose the marquee tool. Choose uh, the elliptical marquee. And we're just going to make a simple kind of circle over here. Now we're going to um, come over here. We're going to invert or deselect certain areas. And I'm going to choose edit and invert my selection. Now it's the area in between the circle and the outside square. And I'm going to select a paint bucket. Black, it will be fine. And I'm going to make sure up here the opacity is 100 and the tolerance is 21 and um, that these both are checked anti-alias and contigu contiguous now i'm going to fill that control d to deselect everything and now we're going to add a uh, second filter you're going to come over to the filter. You're going to select, make sure you're on the frame still, the frame layer. You're going to select Gaussian Blur. You're going to make sure you're at 50. And if you're at 50, select OK. And now all you have to do is, if you need to crop down, if you have any excess to crop, you could select the Crop Tool and crop down a little bit if you'd like, or just leave it as is. Enter. And then all you have to do is File, Save This. We're going to save it as Aged Photo. Make sure you go Quality to 100. Select OK. And then save. And that is it. That is how you make a photo look like it's aged.